Okay, good morning, guys. It is Monday morning, and we're gonna go stare at the sun. <laughs> um, well, we are in Arizona, though, so we don't get to see the full-blown version, but we've already been looking at it, and um, it's starting to happen. Okay, you can barely see it. It's so helpful that there's a cloud there. Let me see if I can zoom. Well, that was pretty neat. I'm super glad that cloud came by. Otherwise, um, I would not have been able to film that. So I'm glad I got to share that. Yeah. Good morning, internet. I need your assistance. I have a serious fish problem going on. So fish people of the world, please, please help me. Do you see that little critter in the water. Oh my gosh, I don't know how to hold this without shaking like a crazy person. You can see it moving around in there. That was a parasite on my fish. What in God's name is it? I literally had to pluck it off of my fish's face this morning. What is that? Oh my god. I am currently on my way to the pet store right now where I got them. I'm taking that to them and asking because I need help. Like, I'm not a fish expert. I have no idea what that is. Um, also, I will insert a picture here in a second where uh, my fish have like kind of like turned a little white-ish. Not like freaking white. Anyway, here's the picture. So. <laughs> I was looking up stuff on the internet and people were saying they get that if they have itch, but they'll like rub up against the glass because they're actually itchy. So I don't know if it has to do with this parasite thing or if it's itch, but my fish are having a struggle right now and I don't know what to do because I did what the fish people told me to do. Like I balanced the water before I put it in there and let, let it all run and it was running for like a week before I got the fish. So I have no idea what's going on. Anyway, to the fish store. Hey guys, I am back from the pet store and I think everything's gonna be okay. I showed them my little parasite fellow and they identified what kind of parasite it was. I don't remember, it was some really crazy name. They showed me a picture of it. Anyway, so they told me what to treat it with and it's just some like, what is it called? General Cure. Takes care of just any kind of parasitic crap. Anyway, so I put that in the tank and hopefully that solves the problem because my poor fish don't need a parasite sucking on their body. That wouldn't be nice. What do you think, fishies? What do you think? You don't want a parasite, no? Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys. See you later. I don't know if you guys remember the last time I showed you the chameleon at my uncle's house, but she is fat and she's bright green now. Look at her. Hi, baby. You're a big girl. Oh my goodness. Let's move this little thing out of the way so we can see better. Wow. She's so bright. Oh, you're big fatty fat. Oh, ho, ho, ho. 
and of course this sweet lady. Sweet sweet lady. Oh, oh, and this big big doofus. Hi, Dingo. Yeah, he's a boy. <laughs> he's sweet. He just wants to lick everything. Don't you, Ringo? Okay guys, so I just finished working on the mural for the weekend, so I will show you the updated progress. Okay, so I didn't work on this side at all. This side's still the same, but I finally finished all of the light pink. It's all done, it's everywhere. And so I finished, it was this whole section right here that needed the light pink. And then this morning I did that little darker section so that's what i accomplished this weekend slowly but surely right slowly but surely